What if water disappeared from Earth tomorrow? The first signs were subtle. Taps sputtered, then went dry. Reservoirs evaporated overnight. Plants withered within hours, their leaves curling like burnt paper. Panic spread faster than dehydration. Governments collapsed. Military convoys scrambled to secure underground aquifers. Wealthy elites barricaded themselves in sealed compounds with stockpiled resources. Poor communities faced immediate extinction. By day three, rivers were dusty scars across barren landscapes. People traded anything for a single droplet, jewelry, vehicles, children's heirlooms. Survival transformed human connections into brutal transactions. Desert tribes and indigenous communities, long adapted to water scarcity, became unexpected leaders. Their traditional knowledge of water conservation suddenly became humanity's most valuable curriculum. Scientists worked frantically, developing synthetic hydration technologies and moisture extraction algorithms. But technology moved too slowly against nature's sudden, complete withdrawal. Humans began to understand water not as a resource, but as a living relationship. We had taken liquid life for granted, believing our technological superiority made us invincible. In our final moments, we realized civilization was never about concrete and steel, but about our delicate connection to water's mysterious, sustaining dance.